Hey, what's up? This is actor Ephraim Fetty Benton. Fucking wax him. Are you fucking insane? I'm not gonna fucking kill the kid. Now listen, man. We fucking talking, right? Actors can come uh, work on their craft, their skills. So I suggest you come down. It's every three weeks. There's a lot of different energies and chemistries when you're performing a scene with different actors. A different actor is going to give you a whole different feel, a whole different um, energy. So it is up to the actor to listen to your scene partner because that is your scene partner in the scene. And in order to make the scene work, if you're taking my direction so literally that you're somehow disconnected from what's happening here, that's not the objective of what we do. I know you. The man that I once was married to was a little selfish and immature, but he's not a coward. It was an experience that I love to have in class. So for it to be something so fresh, you come in with people that you've never seen before and a scene partner you've never, probably never met. And, you know, to keep going with different people, it's an experience every actor should have. In these leaning on a laptop all night, there is nothing wrong with that. Unless you're When you go out there and network, you're mostly meeting people that you don't know, and they don't know what you could bring to the table. So to be able to perform in front of them and you know, network afterwards, you reassuring them that they could use you for other projects. People have actually begun to get cast. Other writers, producers, other directors have came by and they say, Casey, you know, who's, who's the kid in, in the red shirt? And I'm like, oh, you know, that's Siddiqui Fofana. You know, he, let me find out if he's available for you. So people have actually found talent here. So I think uh, any casting director, director, writer, producer that's looking for some new talent, some untapped uh, resources, this is the, the best place to come. All right, you know what? The best thing for us to do is get a hold of Tatooine and just straighten this whole shit out. You know? that, that's the best thing for us. Where, where's the motherfucker? I don't know, man, I don't know. Shit, he's probably fucking laying low. Looking to shoot me in the fucking head. I think mean, that's what I would be doing. Uh, 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 right, right. You know how I get with this anxiety shit. I told you to smoke some shit, bro. <laughs> you know, you're working with di different actors, you know, the same scenes, but you're seeing, like, the different ways uh, and the different choices people make. To me, when you, when you get just sides, something like that, and you don't have a whole script, it is very important to look at what the other characters are saying and what you are saying because it, there's most of the time you have everything you need. Writers that bring their work here, you are seeing your work interpreted by different people in different ways. And sometimes you'll have to ask yourself, have I written this the best way that scene could be? And let me revisit how that scene is being performed because there's something that's missing. What I thought was going to be easily related to the audience, there's somehow it's not working. My name is Sydney Francis and I was a, a watcher at this afternoon session of Actors Gym. I thought it was really, really excellent. It allows so many really talented actors to show their 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 breath, their realm of character development, and I thought it was really, really good. Being able to have actors that are able to work out, you know, work on their craft, and also network at the end, because um, there are a lot of fantastic actors and writers, directors, um, people who are here for the first time, they even just jumping in for the first time acting and doing doing a very good job. First time at the Actors Gym, and um, I'm loving what I'm seeing. I took my hat off to Miles, you know? And for a dude like myself who like to work out, this is a good look, you know? It's more about a workout, it's a gym. Some days you come to the gym, you feel like you can do 20 of it. Next day you come in, you can only do 10, 15. So, it, you know, we're just working out. That's all we're doing. So let's get, take the pressure away, relax. Let's be okay to make mistakes. We're all family. The name is Donald Chartreuse Caliste. I'm here at the Actors Gym put together by Miles Maker. It's a great event. The energy is crazy because you never know what's going to happen on stage. What? Oh, oh. Cut, cut, cut. 
I definitely got an opportunity to, to experience the Actors Gym, a regimen which I stay fine-tuned. The way the, um, the, the facilitator facilitated as well was wonderful. He wasn't over-proselytizing, he wasn't heavy-handed, he was very encouraging. You know, there are beats in a, in a script, and sometimes the writer has placed the beat there. And sometimes it's up, for the, up to the actor to decide where the beat is. And the beat is that magic moment in the script where the audience has a chance to absorb what's going on just with a simple pause or some delay. It's that timing, you know? And sometimes it works with actors that understand each other in the scene in the moment that they're in. I'm just blessed to be a part of it and, you know, the movement. You know, and today I did a scene with J Johnny and Frankie, you know, that's as real as it's going to get in the moment with your other actor, you know, just off book, feeding off each other's energy and just, it's just a great experience. Hi, my name is Lenore Coer and we just wrapped at the Directing Actors Gym. It was amazing. I learned a lot. I'm working on my craft. Um, I've met some great people. Um, it's just been amazing and the talent here is incredible. The people, the writing here has been, it's just an amazing experience and I encourage everyone to come out and support and learn and grow because that's what it's all about. We're in here to, to work it out. It was a great day here at Directing Actors. Uh, I wrote a scene called Moth to a Flame and we had some really amazing, terrific actors who came up and showed their stuff and really got a chance to work out and it's a really great experience. So if you've never done Directing Actors, you should get here. Directing Actors Gym, you should check it out. It's a really great opportunity for actors, especially if you're just sitting around waiting for the phone to ring. Get up, come out here, work it out. This is like the new wave and I'm very happy to be in it at this point and I think it's going to be a brilliant, brilliant addition and it is a brilliant addition to the, to the community of actors in New York and probably LA and the world. So thanks, I'm really grateful. All you actors, if you're an actor, whether you're a merging, um, a veteran, you know, it's all different levels out here, you know, no one's judging no one, everybody's helping each other, so come on down, alright, directors, actors,